A Milwaukee woman charged in a deadly hit and run learns her fate today. 22 year old Sheehan Holmes will spend 10 years in the lockup. Lauren Winfrey is live with more. Lauren. George and Shannon, emotions in that courtroom did run high today as 22-year-old Cheyenne Holmes learned her fate and the victim's family was forced to relive losing a loved one in such an unfortunate way. It still hurts, um, but at least there's some justice to it. Shonda Rushing is referring to justice for her daughter, 23-year-old Savannah Scott. It's a very, very hard situation. I wouldn't wish it on anybody. Rushing's daughter was killed in October after being ejected from a vehicle. The driver of that vehicle, Cheyenne Holmes, blew a stop sign, crashing into another car and a light pole near 51st and Hour Avenue. After the accident, Holmes left the scene. She didn't just get a smack on the hand, so this won't happen to somebody, at least not anytime soon. The court sentenced Holmes to 10 years behind bars with six years of extended supervision. Rushing says while Holmes is away, she hopes she really reflects on the damage she's done. Just just do your time. Think about what you did and the next time that you think about putting a life in your car, just remember you're responsible for that life and it's your job to make sure that they are okay. And this isn't a case of one stranger's actions ending the life of another. Uh, Holmes and Savannah Scott were friends and Holmes says she really hopes Scott's family can forgive her one day. Live downtown outside the safety building, Lauren Winfrey, today's TMJ4. All right, thank you, Lauren.